tis a busy day in the world of tool we just did a new milwaukee video talking about the new tool that they just announced i'll put that at the end of this one and then rigid and ryobi announced new tools and that's going to be this video so the first half of the video talking about rigid second half of the video talking about ryobi so what do we have today so rigid really up in the game in their battery technology so they're going tablets on their batteries right so here's what's nice about this and they did a pretty good job explaining i'll just read it to you and again i'll put all this stuff in a link in the description below I'll take you to the website you can read all this for yourself but rigid tools is excited to announce its first ever max output exp lithium ion battery utilizing tablet cell technology Tablet's lithium-ion cells feature improved power delivery by creating a more efficient energy transfer. I like how they explain this here. So unlike conventional lithium-ion cell construction that only utilizes one or two internal tabs to transfer energy, tablet cell construction maximizes the pathways for energy transfer. This delivers three times more power in a compact size, optimizing performance in high demand applications and run cooler for all day job performances. So if you're using a rigid saw, say a circular saw, and you get some bog down on that, it's never a good thing. You, you're cutting along, you're like, yes, yeah, slice and dice, I'm using, abusing, and all of a sudden, right? That's not real nice like. So these cells will help prevent that and they run cooler. So basically what they're saying is three times the power in a compact size, it's a 4AH. I'm sure they probably will run these in their other sizes, the 12AH and all that. If you have outdoor power equipment, you know, the new string trimmer, the blower, this is going to work very nice in those. Uh, industry leading 21700 cells. So the larger cells are going to be in these. Uh, and it's going to live inside Ridge's 18 volt 4.0 AH uh, max output exp bat rate delivering three times more power a maximum life best performance and of course all of this stuff is going to be covered under their lifetime service agreement you would have to register those tools within i believe it's a three month period we have a video that talks about how to do that laser welded cell straps and upgraded heat skins allow for this to run cooler and live longer through most demanding applications work all day with the most dependable best performing bat race so they're saying this is the best they have right now so it looks like you got a little bit more electronics going on in this uh, advanced intelligent electronics communicates directly with the bat race cells to optimize performance in high demand applications so it's going to say to itself well i'm bogging down a little bit i need to send more power so that's pretty nice other batteries have that on the market just to let you know they're not the first to do that however that is a nice thing to have built for the job site reinforced housing with an added overmold construction shields the battery against tough job site conditions built for a lifetime and it says right here all rigid 18 volt batteries are eligible for rigid's lifetime service agreement the lsa so here is a picture of the inside let me scroll down a little bit more information it delivers more than two times faster cutting versus the 4.0 lithium ion battery with the 18 volt brushless seven and a quarter rear handle circular saw they definitely needed these just telling you straight out drills 40 percent faster with three holes in just 10 seconds with a two and nine sixteenth inch self feed bit so jobs like that things that are demanding more energy that's where these are going to shine so again will they come out with the larger 12.0s and eights and the sixes or whatever they have with this technology i would imagine yeah probably it delivers over seven i'll take that back depending on if this sells good if this sells good which it probably will if you're in a platform you're probably going to want this why wouldn't you want more power more speed delivers over 70 percent faster cutting versus the 4ah a lithium uh, with the 18 volt brushless reciprocating saw so this is just giving you some idea of the difference in circular saws this is going to be where this thing shines so that's the rigid happy to see that they're coming out and advancing their platform with these i think it's a good thing to have because some of the time they're older Bat rays, they don't they bog down a little bit right so you need that added performance and just an fyi it does say available september 2024 so you're gonna have to wait a little while before they're available at the home depot i don't have a price for these yet not even gonna say what i think it is because i could be completely wrong and then people are gonna be like well you're completely wrong so i guess we shall wait and see but september 24 all right so let's take a look at this ryobi not ryobi uh, i'm gonna tell you straight out what they're doing very well they're doing a lot of things very well uh but the one thing where they're really hitting on pretty much all cylinders is their outdoor power equipment they have been very good along with their sweepers and some of their really cool products they're, they're just doing a very good job coming out with a lot of different things but there's so much variety 
with their outdoor power equipment. If you if you go and look, there's like 30 chainsaws that they have at this point, and they have been very very. I have I get comments all the time about you know subscribers saying they they love the chainsaws from Ryobi because we did videos on them. Um, but available April 2024. This is a brand new chainsaw. We got pictures. I don't think we got a video. We do have pictures though. But this is the brand new 18 inch chainsaw, 40 volt. You know, and they're 18 volt stuff. It's okay. It's like really DIY stuff. And then you get a 40 volt, and it's like a, I don't even want to say it's a pro It's just more power, longer run time, more power. You know, but they're they're good saws. They're easy to use, and they're very powerful. A lot of them are oilless. I don't know if this one is. I don't think so. But a lot of them, you don't even have to put the smaller ones. You don't got to put oil on them. So it's just grab it and go. So just to give you an idea price wise, we'll talk about the specs here. Tool only, you're looking at 279. And then with the kit, you're going to get a 40 volt 6AH with that. It's going to be 379. And you're going to get the charger as well. All right. So let's talk about some of the specs here. They are comparing this to a 40cc gas chainsaw with the 40 volt HP technology delivers more power, more power than a 40 cc gas chainsaw 18 inch bar and chain cuts up to 32 inches this saw can tackle cuts up to 32 inches <laughs> just said that with the 18 inch bar and chain making it an ideal chainsaw for felling bucking and limbing adjust chain tension using the combination wrench so it's not toolless some of them out on the market they're toolless it's pretty nice you know this one here you'll have to use a wrench loosen it up adjust your chain do what you need to do tighten it up loosen it up whatever and then you can go that route 40 volt compatibility they have a ton of 40 volt tools and i'm sure if you're looking into this chainsaw seriously you probably are already in that platform so if you want to buy the kit only for a cheaper price that might be the route to go if you're just looking to get into this 40 volt lineup then you probably want specifications 40 volt hp technology delivers more than 40 gas uh, 40 cc over 90 cuts per charge using a 40 volt 6ah and i believe that is in like a four by four I think it is piece of woodage powerful brushless motor so you don't have to worry about changing brushless uh, or brushes uh, advanced electronics and lithium batteries provide more power runtime these things are instant as soon as you pull the trigger and what's nice about it too is that you don't have to worry about mixing gas you don't have to worry about this thing not starting I know the steel comments out there I'm gonna get okay then get a steel if you want to steal I'm just saying for somebody that doesn't use a chainsaw all the time this is not a professional chainsaw. This is something that a homeowner would use. It has some acreage and wants to clean up the acreage. Experience gas performance with just a pull of the trigger. No gas, no maintenance, no hassle. Premium full uh, house chain delivers long runtime and faster cutting. The other thing I will say, and it has an automatic oiler that keeps the chain cons consistently lubricated. So it is oil, which I'm not surprised. The smaller ones, you don't always have the oil. These larger ones, you mostly do. That said, it does have a kickback protection, make precise adjustments with the tool chain tensioning system, onboard tool storage for convenient access. The one nice thing I will say about the Home Depot is when you buy a tool like this at the Home Depot, they always have extra parts like the chains and the oil and all that stuff. They always have that at the store. So if you ever need to sharpen your chain or you just need to replace your chain, you can go up there and they literally have it in stock uh, most of the time. And then you get the five year Okay, on that and the three year on the battery. So, you know, listen, the chain's already out, so it's compatible with the RY18C1. So, pretty cool. I mean, listen, anytime they come out with new tools, I'm happy with it. And they do it like multiple times a week. So, Ryobi really just stepping it up, really just pushing the envelope when it comes to tool production putting the stuff out on the market which is always a good thing because you want that competition whether or not you're in this platform or not it's always good to have that competition because it helps the prices of your brand not go crazy All right so there you go two new tools one from rigid one from ryobi let me know what you think and if you want to check out the new milwaukee ia tool i'll put that video down here Bye bye